here we go. Decisive game. All right, I'm, I'm st sticking with g6. I just got to play quicker. That's important. Seems like he's very dedicated to keep discussing these lines. And I sort of like my position in the last game, so I'm going to repeat that as well. And then try to do better somewhere around here. But what I got out of the opening, I was Bring quite Bring out to d7 once more. And I think I was playing queen c7 here, wasn't I? I think I was. Or is it e5 right away? Might have been e5 right away. Yeah, let's do that. So yeah, once again, apologies for the very restricted opening menu which we're dealing with here. Last game I played knight c4, maybe I can be. Hard fought match. All these games have been competitive pretty much. Um, my worst game has been that second game of the match where, where he crushed me in a banco. I didn't have much chance in that one, he just handily outplayed me. But other than that, I think these games have been very close. Let's just continue developing. Yeah, I don't like my opening play this time. I shouldn't have tried to innovate. I think the old plan with b3 to use his bishop. I'm just going to ignore his queenside expansion for the moment. Because now he can go bishop f8, which he wants to play anyway, and I might have to block in my own bishop with c3, which would be very cruel to... Now I think I'm going to play this move. Poor Mr. Bishop. Yeah. Then maybe look for b5 if we get a chance. I don't want that knight settling on c4. Much like the last game, I think if he puts the knight in there, i got to be willing to kick it out right away. Full concentration. I know I'm not looking at the chat right now, but I really want to win this game, or at least draw this game, guys. Maybe bishop c4, just to scare him. I've thought about this forever, and it only occurred to me, like, very last minute. This are, these are typically horrible moves if you just randomly switch. Rather refined. Okay, let's just maneuver. I think he might be trying to go for knight g5. Some sort of idea with that, so I need to prepare an e 6 as a reply. Try to use his knight over here. Mm -hmm. So if I play bishop e6, I'm going to get hit on e5, so I can't do that immediately. I could play bishop g4 and try to trade my light square bishop for his knight, but do I really want to do that? Probably knight not. Knight g5 is in the air, but it didn't do anything yet last move. And yeah, that's why he tries to stop at h6. I think I'll... Do I follow suit? Maybe I'll have to play knight h5 and then bishop e6. That might be necessary. And make his development a little Otherwise, harder. Otherwise, I don't see how to successfully play bishop e6. Knight h5, which is logical. There's knight on f4, of course. I'm not thrilled to see it there. But by itself, it can't do that much damage yet. Now he goes bishop e6, offering the exchange of bishops. He might end up playing g3 as a way to stop my knight from coming into f4. Probably he will now. I'm no longer better. Actually, I have to start thinking a bit about defense. Because this knight on f4 is not a pleasant house guest to have. Let's play b6. He was threatening a7, so we gotta take an, a measure against that. Mm. So let's not allow it into my house. Mm -hmm. Maybe c5 now. I love to follow up with king g2, but then I'm very paranoid about c5. It's pretty aggressive, but... Mm -hmm. I'll play it safe, but... I'm going for the gusto here. A very double-edged decision. <clears throat> Makes sense, though, I'm afraid, I have to admit. I was planning to play c3, but then I might have some very loose pieces along the b-file, else it's hard to stop his knight from coming to Anyone's d4. Anyone's guess how this will shake out, like the tension in the center? d5 is weak too, I'm just glad that he doesn't have a knight in range of d5. If he could jump a knight in there immediately, he might be in decent shape. Okay, so rook comes my in. My point is if knight d4 I can hopefully take on c5 with my rook, and if takes takes knight d4, then I can take on d4 twice. So that was the train of thought. 
miss c4, however, which is unfortunate. Still, c4 slightly undermines his control over the d4 square as well. Can I go here, or is that losing material? <clears throat> if knight d2, maybe queen b7, although that might drop c4. Doesn't seem to be losing material. Knight d2, yeah, this puts me to a tough decision now. Sharp position. I have a feeling his pawns are a little weaker than mine, which would be good. I think I'm going to take and then play knight g5 and try to get at h3. And again, I'm trying to move quicker, making a conscious effort to move faster here. My knight on h5 is way out of play, though. <clears throat> Don't want any c3 shenanigans. f5, uh, g5 is hanging. Let's go here and attack this pawn. And also defend g5. A queen d7 might have been good there. Queen d7 would have defended both. But this also could be good. We'll see. That's a bad move, but I couldn't think of anything. I'm starting to freak out because I'm so low on time. And it shows in my moves. I've really <clears throat> placed my pieces ridiculously now. that knight going? Okay, I'm just gonna come here, because I don't really understand his last move. Hmm. Now he wants out through d7. Or d5. Let's play e4. Let's take this way. c2 is hanging. Is my thinking. Gotta go for that. He can give a check, but is it, does it matter? Mutual messing around. Sorry, I'm too low on time to give insightful commentary. I have no idea what's going on. I guess it's about equal. F6, I have a check on C7 that much I saw. It takes G3 not working. I'm going to play a little safety on the, the diagonal here. <clears throat> okay, let's come here. Now I'm, I'm down on time a little bit. This is an equal endgame, though. Level endgame. Yeah, this is just equal. Just gonna look for a swap. Hmm. Not much to hope for now. Again, I'm gonna offer him a draw. Draw. Didn't take it though. Could it be possible that I'd be a little bit better here? It'd be pretty extreme for me to win this, but maybe I'll try. Hmm. There, king there. Nah. I'm gonna just offer him a draw. Ah. I wish I was faster. I keep giving him all these draws when he's down to 19 seconds back in a position as a draws. So. 